Hey there, this is Vanessa Duberlay, and I'm so excited to share this with you. If you have been building your online business and you are overwhelmed with all of the posting and the different platforms, and even though you're told just to stick with one platform, most of you are trying two or three. It's just in our human nature, we're trying to build them up and we're trying to do everything all at once. Well, I found a program called Post Planner, and I've heard about it and just didn't take the time to look at it, and I hope I hope that you stick around and see what this amazing platform will do. It will make your life so much easier. Today's video is just going to navigate the system. And then I'm going to do three more videos where I'll go into detail on how to do the three different parts where you can find content, you can plan your content and post your content. Amazing. All right, let's get started. When you type in www postplanner.com. This is the page that will come up. Now I want to show you down here. If you want to take the time and see what each section does, you can go in here and learn more on each one or wait for my, uh, check out my videos and you can use those as well. They are all under a playlist called network marketing tools on my uh, YouTube channel. Okay. So you're going to have a total of four videos. Now it's only $3 a month. They do want you to pay by the year, which is $36. What do you get for that? You can put three platforms on here. Basically it supports Twitter and Facebook and you might say, well, I just have one Twitter account and a Facebook account, but I don't really have any, um, uh, you know, I only have two. That's fine. Just get that, that program. The next level, I'm going to show you the plans and the sign up is $9 a month and you can put up to 10 platforms. Now I started out with three because I just wanted to see how it would work. I'm already ready to go to the the bigger platform with 10 because when you create a Facebook group that you are the admin to, you can schedule your post in there as well. So build up your three accounts and then you can change and build up to the next platform and pretty much they will let you go back and forth. Let's say you had four accounts and you got rid of a Facebook group, went back down to three. It's very easy to, to change your subscription back and forth. But you can see that $9 a month for something like this is well, well worth it. All right, I'm already logged in. Let me just navigate quickly and show you what it does. Like I said, I will get into detail <clears throat> exactly how to do it in my next video. But you can find content. To me, this was the, the, the best part. I don't have to go looking for all my content. Let's say we are looking for industries. And let's say we are in the health and well being industry. So I tap that. I'm looking for content. And right here, there's already some articles here that I can choose down below. I don't know why that one popped up up there. I don't know what that did. I think it, um, here, let me X that out. There you go. There you go. I didn't want that article. But here are some different articles that have to do with health and well-being and you can post them retweet them to your Twitter account how do you do that all right let's let me find one that I actually want on my account <laughs> let's see let's go to uh, let's see education and teaching maybe I'll find something there all right making trading cards Here's advice on life. Any, anybody could use that, right? So all I have to do is select share and then it's gonna share right to my account. I'll pick the account that I want it to go to and then it goes right to that account. So just to show you how simple that is, let's try another section. All right, we're done with industry. Let's go to status ideas. I just wanna show you the all the amazing things that are available to you. We're going to X that one out. Deep thoughts. Let's go there. There's probably a lot of text things in there. All right. See, there's a bunch of quotes that you can just plan and put them on your page. So that's how you find content. Again, I'm going to go into more detail in my next video. Um, post. So after you post your videos or, or all of your content, you can go into post. Now, remember, I've got three accounts. So I, which account am I looking at? I always have to choose my account. If your page comes up blank, that's because you haven't chosen the account that you're looking at. Everything that I have planned comes up on the plan side. 
So I can see what's coming up and what I've planned. Over here on the posted side, I can see what's already been posted. And I have the option to go in and replan it or repost it or view it and edit it. Or I can delete it and maybe not use it anymore. So if you have some certain call to action posts that you have and you want them to frequently be used and recycled, they're right there and you can decide where you want them to go. So what does the plan look like? So again, I have, this is a default plan that just pops up for you. Okay. And you can add to it and things like that. I will show you that in the detailed video, but here, let me show you a plan that I made for my one Twitter account every day. It will post 11 posts during these times. And all I have to do is sit here and maybe, um, I know that every day I have eight posts that are either going to be a photo or a text. So I will go in and make sure I find those and post them and it will automatically put them into the next slot. And again, I'll show you that in the video that's coming up. It is amazing. We're going to do plan first. That's the next video tomorrow. All right. When you come in, it's going to ask you to set. You're probably saying, how did you get all your stuff in there? Down here in the bottom left-hand corner, it says settings. And in settings is where you can go and change your accounts if you want to. So like I said, I've got, um, I have this on my business page for Facebook, but I have other uh, Facebook pages that I'm the admin on. I used to do a lot of challenge groups, so they're all, that's probably what all of that is. They're archived. But just to show you that every single Facebook page or group that I am the admin on will pop up and I can choose them if I want. Right down here is another account. It can go to my profile if I want. I think my profile account, nope, that's a workshop that we have. All right, so I can choose three different accounts and, and plan. And again, if I upgrade my account to $9 a month or $9 a month for the year, they do want you to pay yearly, then I can put 10 accounts in there. Once I have these three accounts about a month advance, a month in advance of posting, then I'm going to go upgrade and go to my um, 10 accounts. So <clears throat> just an idea that you don't have to start with nine, but that's what this does. When you come in as a new person, it's going to ask you to set those accounts up right away. And then you'll have your default account as well. Amazing. This has been a game changer because I, that was probably the part of the online marketing that has been daunting to me is trying to get all the, you know, the posting and, and things like that, all the posting to all the different platforms and getting promoting your content. So this is really going to make it easier. You can sit down and focus on one thing and do a week at a time, do a month at a time and have it all set up and ready to go. And remember, once you post it, it's already there. I can go back in and recycle a lot of it and put some new fresh stuff in. Watch, uh, give me a thumbs up if this was helpful. I cannot emphasize enough that you have to use this. Um, also, make sure you watch tomorrow's video. I'm going to talk about planning first. I know planner says find, plan, and post, but I feel like you should plan first, then find, and then post. So I'm going to change their little motto around. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. We're going to learn how to plan our schedule, and I'll go into detail and show you how that works.